Hey everybody, welcome back to Samsung in a Minute, the channel that trains you on your Samsung Galaxy devices in around two minutes. Today we're going to talk about a brand new feature that's a part of Samsung One UI 5.0 with Android 13, and that is the ability of having stackable widgets. Now, if you're not familiar with Android 13 or with Samsung One UI 5.0 or how you're able to get it, you are able to head over to my main channel, which is Jimmy is Promo. I'll place a link below the video inside the description that'll show you how you're able to sign up to Samsung One UI 5.0 beta program with Android 13. So in today's video, I'm going to show you how you're able to add in your widgets and make them stackable. This way you're able to have them in one spot and you're not going to have them all kind of fluttered around your home screens and taking up pretty much the entire area, which you're able to use for applications and folders. So first off, all you want to do is press and hold anywhere on the screen and you want to hit on widgets. Now through here, it's pretty simple. You just find one that you would like to use. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose this one here, which is the uh, YouTube music widget and you can see the size of this widget here. Now, in order for you to stack other widgets, they have to be the same size. So one thing you are able to do is if you wanted to, you can deselect it, again, go inside, you can press inside of your widgets, and you can find another widget, and then you're able to go through, and as long as you can change the size and the width and the height of these widgets, then you are able to add them in. So as an example, let's just say that we go to the clock, Let's say that we wanted to go through one of the alarms, but you can see that it is a slightly different size. I'm gonna choose this one sitting right here. Now, all you'd have to do is make this one a little bit larger. And as long as this is the exact same size as the previous widget, you can bring it right on top. And here you go, you have two of them being stacked. Or the other way, which is I believe a little bit easier, is let's say that we go through and we delete that one. So as you can tell, I press and held on this widget. So again, let's say that we go back. If I was to press and hold on this widget, I'm gonna click this option here that says add widget. So this is gonna show you the widgets that are four by one. This is the size of the widget that you placed on the screen and now you're able to find all of them. And instead of you seeing the numbers of threes and fours and fives, you're gonna see a lot of them that says ones and twos and some of them have disappeared because it's showing you any widget that is the size four by one. So here we go. I'm going to add that one right back in of the clock. I'm going to go inside of this alarm. I'm going to add in. Usually this is the alarm that I like to toggle on and off. And here we go. We have two of them sitting there. How about we go through and we add in another. So you can add another widget or you can edit the stack. If you edit the stack, it allows you to add another one or also delete. So with this one, I'm going to do digital well-being. I'm going to select this one, hit on add, and there we go. So now this is going to show me my screen time and the applications that I've used and the amount of time. So you can basically just scroll through. There's your widgets in one spot. It's very, very clean. No third-party application. You can select music, hit play. You can pause. You can also thumb up, thumb down. You can turn on. You can turn off this alarm arm right here. Uh, and then let's say you want to take a look at your digital well-being. You can hit on uh, the little uh, uh, refresh button so it can refresh everything or you'd be able to go right inside of the application. So there's the refresh button if I wanted to re-see everything again or you simply tap it. It'll take you inside of digital well-being. And again, if you don't want this to sit here, here's your options. You can either add more widgets. You can edit the stack. So if there's one of these you don't want anymore, you can actually just delete it. You can remove all of them and then also the settings of basically the widget. So if you want to remove it fully completely, then you're able to get rid of all of the entire stack widgets that was sitting right there. So that was everything that I wanted to show off in today's video. Again, this is brand new to Samsung One UI 5.0 with Android 13. Just go inside of your widgets, find the one that you would like to use, and it'll go through and it'll take a look at the size of the widget. So if you make it bigger, if you make it smaller, or if you make it fatter, then you're able to add in again the same size widget and you can get them stacked up. So this way you're not just taking up a whole bunch of room with individual widgets everywhere on the screen. So hopefully you guys appreciated the video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Subscribe on the very bottom left hand side. And if you appreciate this video, the more than likely you'll also like this video. And I'll see you guys later.